They call me the queen. You know, I'm the queen, but I bow to you because I am really serious about service. Being an assistant manager, I make sure everyone is happy and get what they need. So when they come in with a sad face and I have a, give them a couple of jokes, I cheer them up and they go away happy. So here at Rebuilding Center, our mission is all about building community resilience through repair and reuse. We teach repair skills in our education classes, and then we also resell salvaged building materials to ensure that they are affordable and accessible to the people who have greatest need for them. You have all these different departments, lighting, lumber yard, um, cabinets. I mean, it, the list goes on, ductwork. I mean, it goes on, tar paper. And then ceramic tile, you can make backsplashes, uh, you can make bathroom floors. All of this stuff that is perfectly usable and perfectly wonderful and charming and would have ended up in a landfill. The Rebuilding Center has a great history and it started in 1997. We started as a little covered area in the parking lot. And now we have the majority of this block, tens of thousands of square feet of, of amazing materials. About four to five classes a week in basic carpentry, basic electrical, plumbing, home repair, and creative reuse. We're really trying to make repair accessible to people who don't feel welcome in traditional repair and trade spaces. It's a really wonderful thing to see the kind of transformation that could happen after taking a class here. So in my role as a back office person, I utilize technology all day, every day. I mean, all of us do. I use technology for communicating with my colleagues, for all the outreach I do to community organizations that I partner with. All of us use email and calendars and documents and spreadsheets. This is work. We are solving community problems just like every for-profit, just like public entities, and just like all of them, we need technology as a tool in order to do our work. And that's where TechSoup comes in. Having that sort of partnership for education and learning, for opportunities to take classes or have services, that's really you know, what allows us to do our work. Our area of expertise is salvage and education and repair and reuse, not technology. I can't imagine being in the nonprofit sector and not being a member of TechSoup. It is essential if we want to remain on this planet in a sustainable way that we change our relationship with the materials around us. And that is what we do at the Rebuilding Center. We're saving the earth. It almost brings me to tears. You know, saving the earth, you know, that's like saving ourselves. I didn't mean to get teary out there. <laughs> yeah, it's so amazing. I'm 64, I don't look 64. So in about three or four years, I'll probably retire, but guess what? I'll still work, I'll go to part-time. And uh, I'll go to heaven from here. Just wanna put that out.